how to resolve the situation of large rural communities and fewer doctors. Well, if the patient cannot come to the doctor, the doctor can now be connected virtually to the patient with telemedicine, a growing trend to bring health care to remote communities. The village of Cluny in France is testing one of 15 cabins developed by the firm H4D. Once the patient is inside, doctors can keep tabs on diabetes, take x-rays and blood pressure. There is also uh, a scale and um, a sensor to measure one's height, so we can calculate the body mass index uh, of each individual. Um, so these are, uh, these are a number of uh, measuring devices. Inside the booth we also have uh, other features like an electrocardiogram, uh, which uh, can uh, uh, allow to check uh, heart, um, uh, the heart functions uh, of an individual. We also have uh, other features like visual tests or audio tests. The patient can talk directly to a consultant remotely for a screen. This can replicate the environment of a doctor's office. Family doctor Jacques Dupelot, who lives in Annecy, has many patients living far from his surgery. If, through the video conference, the doctor can see the patient is not doing well, he can decide whether to admit him or her into hospital or ask for a doctor's visit. So in this way, it's a positive thing. Rising health care costs and increasing elderly population have reinforced the growing trend in the European telemedicine market, which is expected to be worth 11.5 billion by 2019.